everyone, Dr. Chris Fox here. Today we're going to take a look at Craig's test. Craig's test is used to assess if there's anterior or retroversion of the hips. You're going to have your patient in prone, and during this test you're going to be palpating the most prominent aspect of the greater trochanter along the lateral aspect of the hip here. What you're looking for is as you move the hip through internal and external rotation, when that most prominent uh, a part of the greater trochanter seems to be sticking out the most. It is at this point that the femur is theoretically aligned with the acetabulum. So in Brian, I'm going to find right about there seems to be his point at which he is most in contact and the greater trochanter is most prominent. And I'm going to measure then this angle of the tibia relative to the vertical. The norm is between 8 and 15 degrees of internal rotation, which it would appear Brian is within that range. If, for some reason, someone is in greater than 15 degrees of hip internal rotation, then that would mean that this person is anterior, or has anterior version. And with that, it means that they typically will be walking with their legs internally rotated or an antiverted position. If instead, when it feels most prominent here, their hip ends up being aligned at neutral or sometimes even external rotation, they are likely presenting with retroversion, and these patients typically prefer to walk with their legs in external rotation.